We are oh, testing Johnny. the streaming. Aren't we, Johnny? Aren't we? Uh, no. Yes. I, I put the TNT. It okay. should be on. You, you have a Wi-Fi connection thing? thing. You scroll down from the top. I have no idea. Yeah, yeah okay, you are on. We're on. Are there any watchers yet? People working. There's nobody? Oh, oh this is live live, huh? Live live. Yeah, two th two live thumbs up. Oh, yeah, since so somebody's watching, there is somebody watching. Somebody wrote, okay. hey, hey. Yes. Well, Purpose? I thought we have hundreds of people. We're doing this test. We're going to walk around and see if Eric, this is Eric, and he has hooked up these wireless access these points. Wireless access points. And he thinks he has it this time. If he doesn't, I'm not going to pay him. Now, to show if it's clear, this is a demolition man. It sure is. Without any of the ramps. We're selling it this way. The guy said he hates ramps. Hates them. So we took them all off. You, ever you can't that? even see me smile. I don't like masks. Now, Stephen. Uh, like Stephen's on the way to the camera. You have to come under here. Get out of here. Be but gone. you have to come under. You have Be to gone. Be gone. Be gone a vu. You have to say it correctly. What are we looking at? Stephen is repainting the blue. Okay, this is Miss Pac-Man blue. Okay. Uh, this is the timeline that is actually going out tomorrow. And I'm waiting to make a regular video to put my sticker on it. Look at this. <laughs> Back here. Come in close. We're going to make sure it's clear. Okay, good. Wow. This is an incredibly, horribly dirty and ugly Miss pa Pac-Man the guy sent us in for repair. He had a chase into it. Get that little dirty in my house! Like this is plastics and little things. Look, this is Marking Canada's wonderful new cyber nuts. Cyber nuts. Cyber nuts. We're going to make it better than the cyber nut with the other. This is a special force. This is the only Valley Pinball. I believe it has black flippers. Look at this. It, it, it's absolutely stupid. Because in a dark room, you can't see the damn things. That is stupid. Well, bad design choice. So is that game. Now, we're going to walk back here to see. Well, the warehouse is not turned on right now. No, you creep. No, nope. so the initial test is just going to be locally right here. OK, let's see if it goes outside a little you'll, bit. You'll get some range outside. So we can do a secondary test and turn the warehouse on and see if it can it's see better. Yeah. Get test. Now look, some recycling stuff. Metal. These are the, those are the bars that were in the front of that game. I'm going to show you up. A ski ball computer. Oh look, this is our powder paint center. Look, timeline. Jonathan got these all ready, police force. You see, after you get them powder coated, you have to clean out the holes. Jonathan is exceptionally good at cleaning holes. See, here's the pure black. My competitors say it's not worth it. Just give them, this is one of my competitor's legs. I'm just kidding. Come. I can't dub in anything. Mylars for pinball machines. Uh, this is Sean's make tracks. It's going to get orange T molding. It's got a brand new control panel overlay. That's Mark's Monaco GP that works great. This came in for a new monitor. What's this one? Oh, this is Sean's Superstars with the right artwork finally. This is where we uh, do the show from, the television show. Well, that's our television show cart Timmy bought. This is what that uh, man uh, 
to us. He said, quote, a couple buttons were sticking, but it works fine. Wrong! He lied to me! Okay. Hopefully he didn't spend a lot of money on it. Oh, God, I paid too much for it. I had this beautiful terminal. There. It's beautiful. The guy wanted dimensions. He wanted pictures. He wanted everything. And how much to ship to his house? And that was all I heard from him. We got this traded in. This is going to be glued down. So, uh, we just got this in. Uh, it's a dire need of Frank's battery for it. Uh, we, we have this available. You know, we sell this rubbish, shopped them electronically, but as is, you know, cabinet-wise, we buy it a lot cheaper. Now, we're, see, we're going to explore each room to see what's going on. Phoenix, she's making a racket. I mean, there we go. Uh, did you know Centauri has the smallest video game footprint? of an upright machine. They do. It also is what we call the rocking horse syndrome. You see? Top heavy, huh? Uh, they never, it was never done correctly on the bottom, so you had to put uh, leg levers in. We have not shot this. Somebody did buy this, but I had to buy another one. Here's a burger time that we completely rebade that has uh, the dreaded bulky cane in it. The Tetris is sold. That's going to that Oregon arcade. Do you remember that one? Uh, here's my digger. I'm planning on filming this. I'm not selling this. I want to film gameplay on that. I think you'd like it. Now here's here's a here's a dilemma. Man sent this lease on. He bought the lease on for it. Paid in full as is. We got it all ready. It's been sitting in the back since November second. No sign of them. So I put it back in here so people can play it. If you need to jam a cabinet horizontal, I got this bad news that works. You can have it for 400 bucks just the way it is. It's in the Zaxxon cabinet. See, we're going to check every room out. See? We're going to walk around the corner. Shockingly, nobody has bought the stun runner yet. Thank God it's huge and heavy. Price. Now this one just came in. This is Stupid Street Fighter <clears> 2, <throat> the new Challengers, and it's in the famous diagonal cabinet. The Z-Back. So everybody wants the Z-Back. Anyway, call me and I'll make you a deal on that. I will. Uh, this is so still can't stop. By the way, some people ask me what the buttons are. All they do is they light up different attractions in the room. So when I have parties, the little brats are in here. I can push buttons. I didn't say brats. This made it sound like brats. I said buggers. There's a difference. Now, to finish, we're going to walk in this room. Actually, that's one of the more arguing, the testing things. Do um, you know how many people wanted the stupid checks? When I got it and I called them up, I don't have any money, I lost my job. I can't buy it now, it's COVID. So I have it available. A stupid check. He said this was nice. You'd gone he over it before you gave him money, right? He lied to me, Eric. These people lied to me. Scotty, I'm exhausted. Starving. Yes, I would like to watch your live play live. So. An unsweetened <laughs> iced tea. And I want the best. Are we done with this? No, we're not done yet. I have well, stuff to do. It looks clear, Eric. Oh yeah, I want to see. So yeah, the Steve areas can't like... understand me, Steve. Oh, Steve, Maverick's in. I think you wanted the Maverick, right? Call me on the phone. It's gorgeous. <laughs> Wallace is doing well. I I need to call Wall. 
I do need to call. Uh, shipping, we can ship anywhere in the world. As a matter of fact, we're shipping a joust to London for 600. Just went out. What? Well, yeah, it does. You said just picked up. That timeline has to go out, too. Here, here's money. You're going to treat everybody here to uh, Dunkin' Donuts. It was an up fly fire. How about five bucks? Here's that a cover dollar. everybody? This better cover everybody. Oh. Right to Paulie. I just want an unsweetened iced tea with lemon. The lemons make it sweet. <sighs> hey, fella, how you doing? Thanks, Ginger. Todd should wear a mask on his butt to keep the workers safe. Uh, I see every. Oh, God, we got a lot of viewers. We got Canada, uh, England, and Everett's there. You're the lady, you. Oh, and Paul doesn't want me to smile. The internet will go blank. Well, what do you guys think? I want, can you type your results? All right, Robert Boyd says it looks good. Uh, I mean, I think your Robert's camera, Chicago. I think the camera lens might be a little dirty, but otherwise, yeah, let me, yeah, yeah, bring, me, bring, me this, Mr. Dirty. bring me Mr. Phone real quick. You have incoming call. Well, that's going to have to wait. Do you want to oh, sure. <laughs> you want call? Incoming call. Oh, it's Jeff. Jeff at Class in our case. That, that may clean it up a lot. You know, I'm going to tell you, Jeff from Classic Arcane, I think I said this in the other video, he still has 175 packages not delivered that he shipped in December. He's going to call me, maybe, maybe some got shipped. The, the, the delays are unbelievable. I'm still missing Christmas gifts. Oh, well, yeah. Now listen, this weekend, I got so much garbage to sell to you on Saturday night at 7. So much that Scott has agreed, agreed to come in and assist us on his own time. Whoa! And this you young too. man is going to come in. He's going to work the computing device. There we go. Not for free, though. And we'll do it stream live. We'll do it live. Live. It better work. In fact, here's one of the things we'll be selling. This is actually going to be cheap. A Konami Stupid Basketball. Works perfect plugs into the standard Konami um, stern um, output. It's a vertical basketball game. That's going to be cheap. As a matter of fact, here's the stuff from Jeff. Classic arcades. So, <sighs> these two things. I'm exhausted. I, I'm exhausted. Oh, here's Sean's Shinobi. Sean, your crap is done. Your junk, well, one more day. So it's going to go out by the end of the week. Because I need your money. He just is this cretin. He's going to want to get paid if this works. I'm hoping the picture gets crappy. <laughs> We're going to test. we got to test the warehouse. We're going to do another quick live test next door shortly. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So for now, Jonathan, is there a button there that says end? Um, I guess the exit button out there? Yeah, exit out. Hit that, and we'll see you soon. Hasta luego. See you soon.